Machine simulation is the ability to simulate toolpaths on a digital twin of your machine. Using this feature in Fusion 360 is a simple, easy, and accurate way to check that your toolpaths are safe to run on a machine tool. Autodesk provides pre-configured machine simulation models for dozens of machines. If your machine is not available, you can configure your own custom machine simulation model. Before I begin, I'm going to set preferences. First, I will go to Graphics and set the Degraded Selection Display Style to Normal Display. This controls how selections are highlighted and displayed. Normal is the best setting to use while working with machine simulation. At the time of recording this video, several useful preview features were available for use with machine simulation. I will enable machine axis over travel reporting, machine collision detection, and machine retract and reconfigure reporting. Don't worry if you can't find all these preview features. They will eventually become a standard part of Fusion 360 and will disappear from the preview feature list. Now, I will open the CAM file. I've created a setup and prepared several toolpaths. At this time, the only simulation option available is the standard toolpath simulation. It will show the toolpaths and the removal of stock. want to use machine simulation. I'll right click to edit the setup and select a machine. Currently, I don't have any machines under the My Machines section. I'll select a machine from the Fusion 360 library of pre-configured machines. I'll set the filter criteria to milling and simulation ready. Then, I'll scroll down and select Matsura as the machine tool maker. Next, I'll select the MX520 machine. Fusion 360 will prompt me to download the machine model and ask me where to save the F3D file. I'll save it in the machine models project that I've created earlier. Next, I'll go to the Part Position tab. There are four different Part Attach Point modes. I'm going to use Select Point. Next, I'm going to use Selected Point to choose the geometry on my design that will attach to the machine. In this case, my design appears to be in the correct location on the machine. But for good measure, I will select the Table Attach Point. Please note, the connection between the design and the machine can be offset in the X, Y, and Z axis if necessary. I'm ready to simulate with machine. I will enable the stock and set the viewport to machine base. I'll also enable stop on collision. Now I'm ready to begin machine simulation.
Fusion 360 has detected a collision. If I go to the Info tab, I can see there are 19 collisions. To prevent this collision, I'll need to use a longer holder for this tool. I've changed the tool holder and now I'm ready to try machine simulation once again. The Info tab tells me that no collisions have been detected.